what is going on everyone thank you for clicking on this video and yep i did it i read the comments i've seen what you wanted and you know what i said i've got to make it happen i drove all the way out here to arkansas which i mean it's just it's not that far actually it's about four hours but uh, hey did it for you guys and uh we are about to tour this franklin home called the attic i've seen so many comments about this home and I have to tell you, I see why now after walking in for the very first time just a second ago. But we're gonna get all into it. First off, I wanna show you this exterior. If this is your first time seeing our channel, first off, let me say I apologize for all the noise in the background. Uh, right here on the highway, we're at Hawks Homes in Conway, Arkansas. And so, oh. Got a little quiet. Oh, here comes a big truck. What I was going to say though, if this is your first time seeing our channel, be sure to hit that subscribe button and the notification bell. That way you know when we post other videos like this. It's totally free. All right, let's walk around this side while. So this guy's going to talk forever. No, 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 no. So basically, it's two story, and I'm going to get into all that. All I ask is if you do enjoy, please hit the like button for us. That helps the videos out tremendously. That's, you know, a lot of least a lot of, That's a lot of the reason why these videos perform as well as they do. And it's just by you simply tapping that like button. So if you would dislocate your finger hitting that like, I'm just kidding. If you just hit the like button, I'd appreciate it. Look at all these windows on the back side. So this, this home is two stories, has a second story. It's got a porch down here on the end. I mean, it's got everything really. You can find more information on the house in the description. I'm gonna probably come out that door and we'll take a look at that porch just a little bit more with that being said let's not waste any time we got a lot to do i do want to get a close-up right here and just notice all the different types of vinyl board that we have on this home I'm sure there'll be other options on this I've been seeing this a lot on several of the Franklins. It's just these really, really nice front residential doors. I mean, those, you know, that's a great thing to put into a home. I mean, it really makes it look a lot better and for the for the money. I, I think every manufacturer needs to start doing this, to be honest with you. Okay, I'm telling y'all, it's going to be crazy. Let's go. Hello? Okay, coast is clear. First off, I just like to say it smells really good in here and I don't know if y'all can smell that, but it smells wonderful. So we've got this closet right here off the front door, nice little coat closet, plenty of room for some storage. You know, all kind of stuff you could put down there. Y'all ready for it? Let's look. Let me get let me get you that slow pan. Ooh, ooh, kill him. Ooh. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm gonna get off in that even but hold off though. So this is where you would put your flat screen uh 100 inch. Just kidding, I don't really know what size you could put there. I don't even know what the go and cool size is, to be honest with you. I don't really watch much TV. I watch YouTube, which I know a lot of you watch it on your TV, but I usually just watch it from my phone. So we got built-in fireplace. There is those glorious steps that we'll check out in a minute.
beautiful bar area here that really breaks up your living room and your kitchen. I mean, you got four just massive chairs right here. I can see like four kids sitting there. And if you got four kids sitting there and they're all yours, ooh, prayer's going up. Okay, that was the pantry dance that I have to do for some of y'all because y'all, y'all enjoy it. That's nice pantry. It's really simple. It's a, it's a one, two kind of step. And one day I'm going to basically, I'll, I'll put it on camera and just show you the whole thing. But Here's your little coffee station. Check out that beautiful backsplash. Double door, stainless steel fridge. Check out these ovens. Okay, look at all these cats. I'm not gonna. <laughs> the first thing that happened, y'all just thought was, oh gosh, here he goes. I'm not gonna open every cabinet, just every other cabinet. Just kidding. I really, really like these countertops. We have this beautiful farm sink. Check out the faucet there. Okay, I just can't take it anymore. I've got to open at least one. This went with the same backsplash all the way around here. Man, I like this. This is cool. This is really nice. Check out your vent hood right here. The countertop space in this thing is just crazy. And then these cabinets are big. Like if you have enough uh, pots and pans and all that to fill up these cabinets, first of all, I think you got some problems. Oh, I do want to take just one quick look at that. Make sure you see that. That's something really cool. Okay, so you have your dining area right here. Now this is that porch that we looked at. I'm just gonna take a quick little step. So, you know, you come out, you get your cup of coffee in the morning, you're like, uh, get out of here and get some fresh air. Really, really big porch. I mean, what I like about this porch is if you have like a gathering or something, I mean, I think easily you could have eight to 10 people out here socially distancing <laughs> but uh i don't know why i laugh at that it's not funny but what i'm saying is you could definitely you could have several people out here So we'll go down here, show you these rooms. Oh, I'm glad I almost walked right past this door. Y'all would have been, oh, y'all would have been mad. That's a nice storage room. That's where your stairs go up there. be real brief in these rooms I love the baseboards trim that's just little things that make homes look look really really nice you can check out Franklin you can see uh, you know how their homes are built built really well so we have another bedroom back here We got another closet. This would be like a linen closet for your guest bath here.
Beautiful guest bathroom. Got that really big shower tub combo right here. Not just a standard that you're gonna see. Good size. And then we got, oh, I ain't even been back here to be honest with you. This is my first time. This is nice. But as you know, this is not the laundry room. This is the utility room. And speaking of that, uh, I don't know. I may actually have them out by now, but I'm working on some shirts. I've seen a lot of y'all saying y'all would like to have some shirts, some merch. So I am working on that. Uh, actually, you know, obviously it's, kind of a last on my to-do list. My main focus is trying to find the best homes to video and video in the best homes and all that. But yeah, I'm trying to get y'all some merch. Y'all gonna buy some shirts now? Y'all gonna support a brother? Shirts, coffee cups, just all kind of little stuff. This is a, no, this is room, this room is nice. I love that. I've never seen that in one. Huh? utility room so this right here is probably gonna be where your water heater is exactly there's that end door that we looked at if you're facing the house this is on the right side this door's on the right side i feel like it's always important to stress that because you can easily get turned around in these homes all right so let's go down here come on would you look at that size room this closet is not in the bath which is something that i've seen a lot of y'all say talking about you don't like the closet in the bath so we definitely don't have that going on here We got some light. So this is like built-in storage is pretty cool. I'm assuming this is gonna come standard with these homes. But if you're like, I'm not really into this setup, I mean, you could easily get it without all of this. Okay, let's go. So you come right here, you take a quick left. This is that bad. We got double sinks. They're not right beside each other. Really, really nice countertops. Good storage on both sinks, countertop space. I'm sorry, that's what I meant to say. And then here is that walk-in towel shower. Now this, first off, I gotta say, these are some really nice heavy-duty glass doors. I've noticed in the Franklin homes how they really dress up their towel showers. I really like that. Okay, let's go upstairs. So before we go up the stairs, I just have to say it is massive up here. And uh, that's really all I have to say. <laughs> let's go. Hit these lights. Now, the upstairs is not going to be finished out. But, I mean, the potential that you have. I just really, I'm not going to spend a lot of time, but I do want. 
to show you the size up here. I, man, I just wish I had, let me see if I can zoom in or, I mean, this room is just huge. I'll try to do my best to maybe have some square footage or something on this up here. Can't guarantee that, but I think I should be able to make that happen. But I mean, this, I mean, this would be a perfect finished out for, for a kid's room or just, I mean, I mean, you could even section this off and have two or three bedrooms up here. Just a lot of stuff you could do. And then you come down here on the other side. And you have, I have another two story home on the channel. So uh, you want, might want to check it out as well. It's not near as big as this house, but it is totally different as far as like floor plan and everything. That's crazy. So I hope you have enjoyed another one of our tours. Do me a favor, please just hit that like button for us. Uh, you know, I seen y'all wanted to see this home, so I tried, I tried to make it happen. So if you'll do that, hit that like button and then also take it and share. Share this video with somebody it would be uh, awesome as well or you can put it up on social media whatever you can scroll down see the little share button there, like copy the link you can do whatever i would really really appreciate you doing that uh and don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already so now the moment everyone has been waiting for pricing on this home now we're going to get into that but first let me say uh, if you want more information on this house, you can find that in the description. And then also check out our website link. It's in the description as well if you want more information on this home or just any home that you see on the channel. Also, let me mention that I do now have a second channel. For those of you that have not seen it, link to that will be in the description below. It's called Camper Masters. We're traveling all around. It's me and my brother. We're touring all types of RVs, campers, motorhomes, just anything you think of. So be sure to subscribe to that channel as well. Now, as we talk about pricing, let me stress 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 this is just a general base price for you guys you know that i go all over i tour all types of different homes i'm not out here trying to sell these houses these are for your entertainment just to see everything that's uh you know out there in the industry but i do like to give pricing because i know you want a good idea so this is exactly what this is that's why there's going to be a range because there's it depends on so many factors involved especially a house this size two stories Especially a house like this, I mean, there's so many things you can or cannot do, uh, but this price will be just per dollar square foot, just a good range of what you can get this home for. And I hope that helps. I mean, that is my goal, uh, but depending on your location, all that stuff, there may be other fees involved that I cannot factor for. I hope you have enjoyed this home. This is just one, and I really, I don't want to get too ahead of myself, but this is just one of the awesome homes that I've been able to tour the past few days. And so they're gonna be coming out over the next month or so, really. But stay tuned to the channel. Some I'm talking just some massive, crazy homes. I can't wait to show you all of them. Uh, we're posting three times a week at 6.45 Central Standard Time. Thank you for watching. I hope you have a blessed day, and I'll see you on the next one.